Yoruba elders plead over support of Peter Obi and Bola Tinubu. And fresh controversy stall inauguration of APC's Presidential Campaign Council members. This is Plus Politics. I am Mary Annika. The Yoruba Council Worldwide has accused the leader of pan-Yoruba social political group of Fenifer Pa Ayo Adebanjo of embarking on a campaign of calumny against the presidential candidate of the All-Progressive Congress, Asiwaju Bola Tinubu. The 94-year-old Afeniferi leader Adebanjo earlier pledged his support for the presidential ambition of Labour Party's Peter Obi over Tinubu, who is from the Southwest. Now, according to him, the Yoruba body will not compromise its principle of equity, justice, and inclusiveness because of one of its own who is a frontline candidate. Now, joining us to break this down is Ola Dotun Hassan. He's the Global President, Yoruba Council Worldwide, and Secretary General, Ethnic Nationalities Youth Leaders Council. It's so good to have you join us, Dotun. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Now, it's not surprising because Afenifer is a political organization of sorts and some people would wonder um, why the split within the, the political group as to who to support. Again, Pa Ayo Debanjo obviously is one person and he's decided that this is where he's going to pitch his tent. But then there are those who are of um, the opinion that he, he should support a person from the Southwest. But what's your position on this? You're a young person and you are of the Yoruba Council Worldwide. Are you also part of the Afeniferi group? No, well, actually, I made it clear um, that the Yoruba Council Worldwide is a, is a global body of humanity of all Yoruba groups. And we are dedicated on all of what we want to be. And we believe in the unity, the development, and interest of the Yoruba people, the nation of Yoruba, now Nigeria at large. It is in this light that we have come out openly and boldly to support the candidacy of our own in a national in person of our for the 2023 presidency uh, of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. But in as much as we have done this to rally around something. It is not predicated on ethnic bigotry, nor sentiment, nor parochial opinion. For the fact that the French Ferry has their own uh, personal interest to support uh, the person of Peter Kobe, it is not against anybody's will. But what we frown at and which we are still taking clear and bold for the world to know, is that after any very long papa, Ayuadi Bango, is a negation of the philosophy of, of the Aulawa principles. The ethos of, 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 of after any very is not predicated on skepticism or the, 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 the way they are linked to spread on the person of Ashiwaji Bola And I beg to be clarified that what we are hanging on is the fact that this election should not be refused to an ethnic pout. It is an election of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. If anybody seems to be very brighter and okay, let them tell them. The reason why we are doing this was to assure is based on issue based antecedents. What we believe that this form has capacity and the network that can drive a nation on a national scale, not somebody that will come and still reverberate this ethnic chauvinism. So we believe that if Afeni Ferry is coming up to endorse their own interest, they are free. But if they now go, by crossing the line 
and abuse him and towards you at the expense of your own candidate. It doesn't show respect to the organization. Why do you think, I'm sorry, why do you think, because again, I, I, I've seen that um, um, Chifolu Falaye is one of those who has thrown his weight behind the Peter B presidential um, candidacy, and he's given his reasons. Um, so I'm trying to understand where, at what point in those um, statements that both gentlemen have made, um, that they abused or threw some curses at the presidential candidate of the APC. Kindly explain to me what you mean by what you just yes. said. Yes, you know, um, as far as we know, it's crystal clear to the plan that before now, the approach of the person of Ashura is more or less of a better. Of many years back, we are aware when Ashura was running for the AT governorship, by the majority of supported it. He supported um, uh, 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 the, the other candidates. But with that at the school, also, the dependency of the Gwari administration. Yes, Baba, I have an opinion. Everybody has supported their own. And I guess we know in 2015, it supported the best of Article for 2015, which is a very important which Peter Obi was also part of. If by that same premise of making it known to people that he personally acquired a job, the test the person of the Wajubola. It is no longer going to be a surprise to see hang on the same statement to support uh, um, Peter Obi. So if for the fact that at the instance of John Williams then under the eleven supported uh, activity, he supported them during the 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 Nateko, he had his issue against Ashua. He has always turned against the person of Ashua. So it is more personal than national. And for God's sake, for the fact that we are appealing, we are not telling him of Yoruba, oh, this is our candidate. We are only appealing to people, let us give a candidate the support. I'm so sorry, Doctor. I need to come in quickly. You keep saying you appeal. Everybody has a right to, to their vote. Everybody has a right to support whoever they want to support. So again, why should you be telling the Yoruba Council worldwide uh, as the Secretary General or, and those are, or who are Nigerians of ethnic nationalities who to vote for? Why should you tell them who to vote for. Again, again, I'd just like to put it, I'd just like to throw it in there. That, that, sorry, I'd just like to throw it in there. Dr. 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 Hold on, hold on, please. I'd also like to quickly state that Chief Olufalaye came after Pa Ayo Debanjo had spoken and said that he's a Fenifere. As far as he's concerned, a Fenifere has not taken a, a stand or a position, but he as a person is saying that in fairness, if you're a fair-minded Yoruba person, you would know that it is the turn of the Igbos. And for him, he's throwing his weight behind Peter Obi. I'm wondering, again, you are yet to tell me what part of that statement makes him uh, someone who's cursing or abusing your candidate? Because it sounds like you are in support of Asiwaju. You know, from the, from the world of Olufala, uh, it shows that there is, uh, there is a fact in the house of our territory. It shows that they are not speaking with one voice. It shows the disunity in the organization. So, and in the interest of peace and tranquility, we know that there have not been any um, call up by our territory that this is what they want to do. For example, whatever we are doing, we go around, we shout opinion. We have just people of of different uh, um, background and interest in the entire environment. Before we arrive at the Dr. I'm so sorry, we're, we're getting feedback from you. 
Uh, that's why I'm so sorry. We're getting feedback from you, and I don't know where that's coming from. I don't know if there's anything that's on on your end, but we're having feedback. It's very difficult for me to hear you. The basic thing is, the Euro Party could do the evils. But in the interest of how election has been put up, we have witnessed a whole lot of thoughts around in terms of how of columny has been targeted on the person of Ajo. For the uh, uh, representing the interest of other people, if I should Ajo has come out to say, okay, it is my turn I want to run for the election. If I based on his own um um interest in the people of the AP but what, is, what, is, what is the interest of the Yoruba people? Because you see, you just start, when you started up this conversation, you said, you, said, you said that if people must support a candidate, it should be done in the best interest of Nigerians. But now, you're talking about the interest of the Yoruba people as opposed to the interest of Nigerians. So, what these two gentlemen are saying is that they would rather a Pital be because they think that it's not just the turn of the Ibos, they think that he can deliver. And I said to you that this is personal, but you're also coming back to me to talk about the interest of Yoruba people. What about the interest of the rest of Nigeria? Listen to me. Within my prologue, I assure you is a regionalist. Somebody who stabilized, carrying the entire along. You can see it's a little of complaint from the Africa land to the Yoruba, we are not started to get any Yoruba land. It's most of the investment and the political violence is from the north and the southern part of the world. The whole other, uh, other region in Thailand, he has been so proud every race in Nigeria. For the fact that it's our they try to us that we have a person who is representing who has you to also to start it. And if it's coming, it's coming with a book that okay, we are bringing up the topic um agriculture education. Well, well, that, that's campaigning. We're, we're also also trying as much as possible. But possible the national I'm sorry, it also, we're not allowing people to campaign on this show. So, again, we'll stick... We'll, sti well, I mean, you're already telling me, you're telling me what his blueprint is, and that's, that's not necessarily what we're talking about here. We're talking about the support of Yoruba people in Afenifere as opposed to what people are saying. Because, I mean, Festus Kiyamo has also come out to say that, um, you know, what Afenifere is doing is because they've been paid. So, but th does that mean that the people mm -hmm. who are in Afenifere cannot make their own personal choices as opposed to being lumped up no. as people who have been bribed? No, listen to our own, our own um, opinion. We not put this on the table. We are fighting Afenifere for endorsing people. What we are only questioning Afenifere for is that they should be watchful. For the fact that they have endorsed their candidate, they don't need to to chastise the person of Ashiwaju at the expense of Peter Obi. That is our clarification. Nothing more, nothing less. So we are not competing on the fact that, oh, why are you? We are not asking the why right question. We are only telling them, limit it to your candidate. Don't think Ashiwaju in bad life, which will come back to affect our relationship with the South Eastern people on the modern scale on the man on the street. So we are only to the question. As the Secretary General of all the two groups in Nigeria, I hope over 450 ethnic groups like duty. I'm not speaking to a local opinion or sentiment or selfish view. I've only come to oh we have a kind we have given out the food. I pray the ferry has two months to support this person. It shows that in Yoruba land we have seen a free field for people to do things accordingly. But what will now become a late a thread agenda? Okay. That the person of Ashwan is not the point of target. It is not something we will take from our friend. We we'll reject that 
and we want our friendly parents to come clean. That Ashwati from Kenya then, that did Ashwati and come against their citizens. We know a whole lot of it in fighting. We are led to the Afghanistan Renewal Group. We have led to we have a lot of breaking away from Afghanistan. But see yet, Yoruba is still one. Okay. And we are not divided. Okay. So, whatever we are putting forward is to let our people know that Ashwati should not be compromised in the manner that we have been painted. Okay. I have two questions. It's two pronged, and I want you to quickly answer them before we wrap things up. Um, when you talk about you, you want the Eurobars to be united. Does that unity boil down to all of them accepting to vote for no. the candidate of your choice? Secondly, no. Um, why do you? Why do you no not? Point. Sorry, let me ask the second part of the question so you can answer both. Okay. Um, do you not think that it's time for the Ebos to also take a shot at the presidency? We've had an Obasanjo. We've had an Obasanjo. We've had speakers. We've had the Meiji Bankoli. We've had Baja is still there. We've had so many Yoruba people. Shouldn't it be the turn of the Igbos? I mean, I'm just asking a question. You can make a case. Go ahead. Yes. As far as what I said earlier, we cannot stop anybody. Even as far as I'm concerned, I also have right to be the president of We are not putting a peg or a plug in the wheel of Igbo people to run for them. And Igbo should not be as though this is we are campaigning against them on the point of ethics, Igbo should know. For the fact that Peter Obi is not the only candidate to run as an Igbo man, or neither as the only Europe running for 2023 election. There are other candidates. But we have only just chosen, okay, this is what our own choice. Another group can choose another person. And uh, who, the and who is their us? Own when you say this is our own choice, choice, it sounds like you're speaking, you're, you're a man with one vote. How could you be speaking for all of the Yoruba people and saying this is our own choice? How we can you tell, how can you tell that all Yoruba people want to vote for Tinubu? Because this, no, is, this, is, the, this, no, is, this is the picture that you're painting that. to me. If, even, even, even in Evan, when, when, when the Evan was passed out of Evan, because God believe all in that they not think of at a particular point, they have to do this fact. So for us, we are not putting we are not putting up under a club or a, a despotic arrangement or totalitarian view that we must vote for as you are doing. Put your conscience, put your your future, vote for nationalism, vote for interest that will bring up the okay. East Nigeria to our school. Okay. All so, right. that is what we are saying. We are not saying, oh, we are coercing people. The way people are going about this whole thing, it's about our people. We are not coercing people. We are here. You, know, you have to appeal to people. This is the area. This is how we want to go. But okay. in all fairness, as leaders, we need to also look at the way we are bearing interest, the overview. Okay. From the point of logic and reasoning, that this is the best way to go. This is okay. the best our freedom can be channeled. This is the best way we can function in democracy. Okay. How do we need to achieve these key things, these factors, and settling things that we need to put in the fore for good governance to All come right. to the fore? All what right. is our own agitation? All right, Dr. Hassan is the um, Secretary General, Yoruba Council Worldwide, and of course, he's part of Nigeria Ethnic Nationality Youth Leaders. Thank you so much for speaking with us. We appreciate it. It's a pleasure. All right. Well, thank you all for staying with us. It's still Plus Politics. We'll take a quick break. When we return, we'll be discussing the APC presidential campaign controversy. Stay with us.